Here we're asked to simplify radical 80 plus radical 125. So how are we going to go about this? The first fact we need to understand about radicals is that when you have a product under a radical, you can separate this into the product of the two radicals. You can separate by multiplication. You cannot separate by addition or subtraction, but you can separate by multiplication. Well, what that means is if we have something like 80, if we could figure out a way to factor 80 so that one of the two factors was a perfect square, for example, 80, as it turns out, is 16 times 5. Well, then we can split this up into radical 16 times radical 5, and we're able to simplify radical 16. The square root of 16 is 4. So this just simplifies to 4 root 5. 80 equals 4 root 5. Similarly, 125, we could figure out a way to factor this, in where one of the factors is a perfect square. Well, we notice that 125 is divisible by the perfect square 25. It's 25 times 5. Well, again, separate by multiplication, perfectly legal. And the square root of 25 is 5. So this is 5 root 5. That is the simplification of the square root of 125. Well, now it's much easier. We have 4 root 5 plus 5 root 5. Well, if you have 4 of anything plus 5 of that same thing, what you have altogether is 9 of that thing, 9 root 5. And this is answer choice A.